Okay, now we're going to take a look at the arteries for the intestine. And remember we said the abdominal aorta has three unpaired branches, the celiac trunk, which is going to come off and feed the pancreas and the stomach, the liver, and parts of the duodenum, the superior mesenteric artery, and then the inferior mesenteric artery. On this model right here, we see the superior mesenteric artery right here and the superior mesenteric vein right here going up on top of the duodenum, and it'll look that way on pretty much every model. Here's superior mesenteric artery and vein, superior mesenteric artery and vein. If we flip this pancreas one over, you can see it nicely. Superior mesenteric artery, superior mesenteric vein. So it'll course right on top of that duodenum. This one as well. You can see superior mesenteric artery and vein right here. Okay, so those are coming straight off of the abdominal aorta. Superior mesenteric artery is going to branch and feed the right side of the um, large intestine and the ileum and the jejunum. So superior mesenteric artery first branch is right here and it's going to go up towards the transverse colon. So, so this is middle colic because it goes up to the middle part of the large intestine. This is right here is not a branch from superior mesenteric. It is gastroduodenal coming from the celiac trunk. This right here is a second branch off of the superior mesenteric artery. This is right colic. And this is going to come down and feed the ascending colon. Then you have another branch going to the ileocecal uh, sphincter, basically. And that's called iliocolic here. These small branches here are your ileal and jejunal branches that feed all the ileum and jejunum. So those are the branches off the superior mesenteric artery. Now, off of the main branches from the superior mesenteric artery, like middle colic, right colic, if you go all the way down, you notice that it branches and basically courses along the edge of the large intestine all the way around. This artery all the way around the margin of the large intestine is called marginal. Off of marginal artery, you have straight arteries that go straight out to the intestine. So all these little short ones are straight arteries. And you would have veins that follow most of these arteries. If we go farther down, we can look at the inferior mesenteric artery, which is here. You can see it poking through the mesocolon, coming from the abdominal aorta. So this is inferior mesenteric artery, the main trunk. And this one only has three branches. So this will feed the rest of the large intestine, the left side. So the first branch here is left colic. And it's going to give off a bunch of branches for the descending colon. And then you're going to give off some branches that are going to go to the sigmoid colon. Okay, so these would be sigmoid arteries. And depending on the model, you'll have one or more than one. And then you'll have a terminal artery here at the very end that goes all the way down to the rectum. I don't know how well you can see it on this guy, but this one right here. And that's a superior rectal artery. So if you see it going to the rectum, it's superior rectal. So, superior mesenteric artery and vein, middle colic artery, this is gastroduodenal, right colic, iliocolic, ileal jejunal, inferior mesenteric artery, left colic, sigmoid, superior rectal, marginal artery, and straight arteries. And I just wanted to show you those same vessels on a different model. So this is this model. This is a really nice model to see a lot of structures on. If we look up here, we can see our straight arteries, marginal artery, coursing all the way around the margin. We can see our superior mesenteric artery and vein. Okay, and it's going to give off this artery going to the transverse colon, so this is middle colic. It'll give off 
this artery going towards the ascending colon, so this is right colic here. Actually, I think on this model, this is right colic, number 18. This is just part of middle colic here. So this is middle. This is right colic artery and vein. This would be iliocolic artery and vein even. And all these little ones are ileal jejunal arteries and veins. <clears throat> this is your inferior mesenteric artery. Here's your left colic. This, these would be sigmoid here, and you can't see superior rectal, but that would be the continuation of this vessel down straight. So superior rectal, sigmoid, left colic, superior uh, mesenteric artery and vein, inferior mesenteric artery and vein, middle colic, right colic, iliocolic, jejunal and ileal branches, marginal, and straight. Okay, this model I wanted to show you because you can see the vessels, but they're backwards. Because we're looking from the back side here. Okay, so here is the rectum. This is your cecum, appendix, ascending colon, hepatic flexure, transverse colon, splenic flexure, descending colon, sigmoid colon, rectum. So the uh, superior rectal is easy to identify because it goes right down to the rectum. This would be sigmoid here. Okay, so this is your inferior mesenteric where all these branches are coming from. And then this is your left colic. And then again, you have marginal and straight. So this is inferior mesenteric artery with its three branches, left colic, sigmoid, and superior rectal. This one then is superior mesenteric. Okay, your pancreas would be here. This is going from your duodenum into your jejunum. So here's superior mesenteric artery. Remember that first branch goes up towards the transverse colon. That's middle colic. And again, you have marginal and straight coming off of that. Then down here, you have right colic, which is going over to feed the ascending colon. And then you're going to have your iliocolic. And then you have, we'll have lots of little branches coming off of here that will be jejunal and ileal. This doesn't really show a whole lot of those. There's a middle colic, right colic, iliocolic. and then these small branches would be ileal and jejunal, and they're not on here because these are all going to the large intestine. They would kind of pierce through this uh, mesocolon and go towards the front.